muscle cramps, a very, very common uh, thing we see in uh, our offices on a daily basis. Uh, it's an involuntary and forcibly contracted uh, muscle that does not relax. Uh, the muscles work in synchronicity to maintain, for example, our posture. So often they'll pull against each other and um, give us a pain. So a muscle that involuntary contracts is a spasm. If this spasm is forcible and sustained, it then becomes a cramp, leading to this hardening of a muscle. Um, they can last anywhere from a few seconds to you know, 20, 30 seconds, uh, even longer in some cases. They involve part or in the entire muscle, um, most commonly found in adults, but some children may get. Uh, the cramps uh, of the extremities are common, especially in the calf. It seems to be the most common complaint, uh, often known as a charley horse. Uh, sometimes even the muscle of various organs can be involved, uh, the uterus or the intestinal tract, causing uh, different types of symptoms. It may result from an injury uh, as a protective mechanism. Uh, common ones, though, most are going to be seen at rest or night cramps. Someone wakes up with a spasm of sorts. Uh, dehydration in athletes, especially, is a, another common cause. It's often found with low blood levels of calcium or magnesium that will cause increase in the uh, nerve levels and the muscles they stimulate. Uh, hence where athletes or pregnant women are going to be uh, pretty common um, uh, people to uh, experience these things. About 60 to 65 percent of magnesium is often or, or is found in the bone and the rest is in um, the muscle. It is uh, biochemically required for most functions in the body, so magnesium is very, very important. Signs and symptoms, um, nausea, vomiting, muscle weakness, and, and spasms, uh, often uh, sourced through nuts or legumes. Uh, however, in an elite athlete, for example, it's very difficult to get the magnesium in a diet alone, hence where supplementation is required. Thank you.